system is so strong that it would take an utterly enormous weight for your muscle to even be aware of it. Any level of force that would get the attention of your muscles would destroy your skeleton. If that's what you want to do to yourself, be my guest. Insofar as drawing inferences vis-a-vis -vis free weights and a Nautilus machine, let us analyze that stupid remark. And it is a stupid remark. What does a barbell do? It provides resistance against movement powered by muscular contraction. What does a Nautilus machine do? It provides resistance against movement powered by muscular contraction. A Nautilus machine is a barbell. Pure and simple. If you want to be a competitive weightlifter, then you're going to have to practice in order to develop the skills required for competitive weightlifting. But I'll tell you something plain and simple. Doing so will do absolutely nothing for your strength. Not a damn thing. But it will eventually destroy some of your joints. You can count on it. Explosive training is simply criminal. It's stupid as hell. Ignorance we can deal with. Stupidity, well, that's genetic. You can't deal with it. Long before you were born, son, I was dumb enough to listen to some of the assholes out there that call themselves, call themselves experts. As a consequence of which, I all but destroyed my skeleton before I realized what the hell I was doing to myself. Now must all of us repeat everybody's mistakes? If you want to train in that fashion, go right ahead. I can tell you in advance what it'll do to you. I already have. You fail to understand that, that's your problem. Yes. I'm, you're going to have to speak up. That's pure bullshit. Why the hell would a football player want to do squats or bench presses? What? What? I know, and that's stupid as hell. Fifteen years ago, I said the best thing you could do for football would be to take the top 500 coaches in the country, put them in a 747, and fly it into a mountain. 